Before we begin today's video, I just want to give a quick shout out to the winners of the top 10 in this competitive season. These guys have worked so hard to be the first 10 people to get the Infernal Guardian Dream Knife. So I do believe that they deserve a shout out. So without further ado, let's begin with the shout outs. Again, sorry if I pronounce these names wrong, but uh, shout out to Four Finals, shout out to Freezy Riss, shout out to Sinister1975, shout out to Congamer2331, shout out to How To Do That Please, shout out to Liam the Coolest 95417. Shout out to Immorses. Shout out to Vastris. Shout out to Dark Knight Rising. And last but not least, shout out to the first place winner with 30,000 competitive points. Shout out to Diego the Coolest 9541. Congratulations to all you guys for winning the Infernal Guardian Dream Knife. This was a long season, so there was probably a lot of grinding involved. And of course, shout out to everyone who got in the top 100. I'm not going to say everyone's names individually, but hey you know who you are shout out to you if you got in the top 100 so yeah congratulations to all you guys and without further ado let's begin today's video How is it going, Data Bites? There's no data here. Welcome back to another exciting episode of Roblox Assassin. Today on Assassin, we have a brand new top 100 prize to show off in battle. As you guys know, the September 2020 season has shown us a brand new generation of leaderboard prizes. There was a new top 100 prize and top 10 prize for September 2020. So in this video, we are going to be showing off the brand new top 100 prize. So if you are in the top 100, by the end of the season you got the holy guardian mythic and i actually went and got top 100 for that season and as you can see i now have the holy guardian mythic knife apparently when the season ended there was like a bug and a lot of people didn't get their prizes including me for a little bit it took me a hot minute to get my prizes but yeah it seems like prisman fixed it and manually gave everyone the prize for you know those who got that bug but yeah guys in this video we are going to be trying out this brand new holy guardian mythic and we're going to talk about its current and future value if you guys are excited for this episode of assassin then be sure to drop a like on this video it helps out a whole lot and comment down below holy guardian and also guys if you're new be sure to subscribe once we hit 200,000 subscribers we are going to give away a competitor blade really good knife right here this is a much earlier top 100 prize and it's really valuable so be sure to subscribe so that you are notified about that no data merch link in the description and don't forget to use star code purple when buying robux and roblox premium it really helps me out to continue making these videos guys it was really really hard to get in the top 100 it takes a lot of grinding to get on the top 100 on the leaderboard so if you could use star code purple that would really help me out because it took a lot of work to get this mythic so before i even equip the holy guardian here is one thing that really interests me for most competitive prizes when you hover your mouse over them it specifies that they are a competitive prize so you know i put my mouse over competitor blade it says comp reward at the top right you can see right here it says comp reward competitor blade 2 glorious axe comet uh void champion champion axe champion axe 2 they all say comp reward because they were a leaderboard prize they are considered to be a comp reward now the exception to that is the elegant blade and the champion blade you can see when i hover my mouse over the elegant blade you can see it doesn't say comp prize and uh same with the champion blade it doesn't say that at all and it seems like the holy guardian is yet another exception i hover my mouse off the holy guardian you can see it doesn't say comp prize which is interesting it doesn't say competitive prize i obviously don't have the infernal guardian just yet so i'm not sure if the infernal guardian has that as well but i'd imagine it says the same thing because the holy guardian doesn't say comp reward but yeah let's go ahead and play a round of infection and i gotta equip the holy guardian almost forgot to do that there we go all right so i am the first infected but here it is guys the holy guardian mythic this is the sixth ever top 100 prize for a competitive mode you can see that it is a nice bright white knife with a yellow handle you can see there's a yellow handle right here and that handle actually goes through the knife which is kind of interesting i guess this golden handle kind of just wraps around around the knife kind of sort of so yeah what's really interesting about the holy guardian is the effects first of all this thing glows i feel like the white parts of the knife are just always glowing which looks really cool it really makes the knife a lot more angelic with that awesome glow you can see that the holy guardian also has that force field effect a handful of knives have that effects like comet and black hole 
Imp, Dark Commander. You can see that the Holy Guardian has that as well. You can see there is a force field around the Holy Guardian knife. Holographic outline, people also call it the holographic outline. And you can also see that there are some sparkles around the knife as well that kind of appear and disappear. We got some white little sparkles right there. White dots stars i don't know what to call them but they look pretty cool so i say this knife has at least two effects i guess you could call the glowing a third effect but yeah you can see there are quite a few effects around the knife so yeah overall i would say this is a pretty cool knife again i feel like the actual knife portion you know not too much to say about it it is a bright white knife with a yellow handle wrapping around the knife and yeah let me know what you guys think about this knife i remember when this knife was first shown you know in competitive mode i feel like a lot of people thought it was boring but i also remember when common and black hole first came out people really didn't like those knives common and black hole because it didn't show the effects like you see the picture of black hole here it just looks super bland but then when you equip it it's like whoa look at those effects this knife is cool and i feel like the holy guardian is kind of sort of the same i mean even though you can see the glowing effects i just i feel like you can't really judge a book by its cover and i feel like the effects just make the holy guardian look super super cool so yeah let me know what you guys think about the holy guardian i think it is a really cool knife and it's definitely fitting as a top 100 prize and again let me know what you guys think about the prize swap because again the holy guardian was kind of originally going to be a top 10 prize so yeah do you think the holy guardian should have been a dream knife as a top 10 prize let me know what you guys think again personally i think it could have gone either way i think the holy guardian would have definitely made for a good top 10 prize just because it's super angelic so it would definitely fit as a dream knife but at the same time you know the infernal guardian is definitely more dark and edgy so it kind of makes more sense how the dark and edgy knife would be the better reward but yeah guys i hope you guys are hyped for what is coming if you guys don't know the halloween 2020 event for assassin was officially confirmed so yeah guys a halloween event will be happening this year zikoi confirmed it well zikoi confirmed it last year and it didn't happen so who cares but prisman confirmed it so yeah there should be a halloween event this year which is really hype and if you guys don't know there is also going to be a paintball revamp there's going to be a paintball version 2 map i'm probably going to make a speculation video on those updates so uh i'm not going to say everything in this video just look forward to the speculation video because that's probably going to be coming very soon but yeah there is some pretty hype stuff coming to assassin and prisman is still working on his secret project so when that comes out that is going to be awesome as well but yeah guys overall this is a super cool knife i honestly really like it i grinded two weeks straight to get this thing and i'm glad i did this is a pretty cool knife but yeah guys let's talk about the value of the holy guardian mythic what is this knife going to be worth so at the time of this recording the holy guardian does not have a value seems like it's a little too early for zikoi to add a value on the value list at the moment so i'm really just going to compare it to comment the initial value of comment was 210 exotics which is a lot actually but yeah guys just know that the holy guardian is a top 100 competitive mode prize this knife is going to be really good pretty much all of the top 100 prizes are really good i think comment is like 200 glorious axe is 230 competitor blade 2 is 340 competitor blade 1 is 370 uh elegant blade is 500 exotics which is insane now again maybe we can assume that the initial value of holy guardian is going to be around 210 because again that is what comet was worth when that first came out now it is likely to go down a little bit over time and the reason for that is we are probably still going to have more seasons with the holy guardian so there are going to be more chances to get this thing so it is probably going to go down over time because there's going to be more of them and you know people don't really want to trade for this quite yet because it's like oh you can just grind for it in another competitive season so yeah this thing is going to go more and more down slightly until there are no more seasons with the holy guardian and the amount of seasons is obviously going to vary usually it is three to five seasons i believe elegant blade got five seasons competitor blade one got four seasons competitor blade two got five uh glorious axe got three but that was because of a duping situation where someone duped some glorious axes so to compensate prisman made three seasons and comet had four seasons so again we don't really know how many competitive seasons the holy guardian is going to have again i would say three to four i think five is a little bit too much for this knife but yeah guys even with that situation in mind the holy guardian is going to be extremely good 
All top 100 prizes are just extremely good. They're some of the best knives in the entire game. And yeah, Holy Guardian is going to be up there with the best of the best. This thing is probably going to be worth like way more than Holiday Saber. This is going to be an incredibly good knife. So if you got this thing for yourself, be sure to hold on to it because it is going to be really good. And if you want to get this thing for yourself, there's probably going to be more competitive seasons. It's going to be a really difficult grind, guys. Getting top 100 is not easy, but if you pull it off, you will get a really good knife for it. But yeah, guys, that is going to be it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode of Roblox Assassin. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and those other things that YouTube people do. And I will see you guys in the next video. Stay purple.